You might be thinking, why are you making vlogs? This was my logic behind it. I'm really bored. None of my friends are here anymore, um, other than ones that don't live on campus, so it's harder for me to see them. And I have like nothing to do, no one to talk to, I don't have a roommate, I have my fish. Um, that's about it. <laughs> I did hang out with my friends today, I'm not completely like on another planet, but they are all leaving for a break and I'm still staying here for D term, which is a weird term my school has if you don't go to my school. I don't really want to explain it, <laughs> but um, yeah. And I really enjoy watching vlogs. I watch them when I'm bored. I watch them when I'm doing stuff to like keep me company when I'm alone, like things like that. I feel them really comforting and really entertaining. And I feel like other people also feel the same way. That's why vlogs are so like popular. And vlogs look really fun to make. So I decided to make some. So yeah, welcome to my first vlog. So I'm walking to the shuttle to go it's really fun there's a lot more people out than I thought and it's because I thought it was like really late because it's like dark AF outside and it's only like seven o'clock so done at Sally's they had a lot of stuff on sale so I kind of bought extra stuff but it was buy one get one free so mm -hmm. now I'm on my way to Petco and I'm gonna get stuff for my fish tank maybe some more guppies depending if I'm feeling froggy while I'm in there we'll see um, weird thing this like pale blue bug is literally like I don't know, following me around or something. I saw them when I was at school and they were like driving really slowly next to me and now they're here, like after I've already taken the shuttle somewhere else so I'm not at school anymore. It's probably just a coincidence but it's like, mm -mm. if I get murdered, it was a blue bug. <laughs> conclusion to taking you guys shopping. So I guess we'll start with the funnest part, Ulta. I had a ton of Ulta points saved up and I usually save them up for buying people Christmas presents, but I decided to make people presents this year instead. So all of the points that I have saved I just used on myself and I spent well over my points like $15 but, um so I've seen these on Instagram and YouTube and Twitter like basically all over the internet it's like a rose quartz roller you roll it on your face and it's supposed to like firm it it also comes in like jade and it has like instructions on how you roll it on your face I don't know. I thought it sounded fun and I had points so like I always try to get something like super fun and that I've never tried before with points because that's how you treat yourself. And I got this MAC Shape Plus Shade Brow Tint. Yo, but this was on clearance so I got it because I need new brow stuff because I'm dyeing my hair and this is darker so... Oh, I got this like small size 
Peter Thomas Roth Hungarian Thermal Water. <laughs> I really like nice skincare stuff because I used to have really horrible skin and now I don't. So I really like to take care of it. Mascara because I've been running out of mascara. I've been like scraping the tube, adding eye drops, warming it up, all the tricks. And I think it's finally like done with me. Like it's done. It's broken up. It's moved on. Like it's, it's done. So I got some. Then all I got was makeup wipes because I needed makeup wipes. It's not very special. So then at Sally's, all I got was stuff for my hair. Um, I got black cherry for like the most of my hair. And then light burgundy brown, which is like kind of reddish. And this is dark brown reddish and this is light brown reddish. So this at the top, this at the bottom, um, and then obviously developer to go in the hair dye. And then Ion was having a buy one get one free sale. So I originally picked up the Brilliance Shine Spray. I think my hair is like nice, like it's not actually dead or anything, it's just like kind of dull. So I'm going to try this, I'm really excited. And then. Speaking of dead, dull hair, um, I got this when she told me they were buy one, get one. So I was like, oh my god, I gotta get something. So I like ran back, grabbed something really quick, and then I like, barely even looked because I was nervous. <laughs> but I got heat protecting smoothing spray. So I can use this before I fix my hair, this after I fix my hair, and I'll have like basically the most beautiful hair ever. And then at Petco, I got two male guppies and three female guppies and they're acclimating in their tank right now and I'm also going to do a water change so they're like not here but I'll show you them and then I got this purple plant thing because um it looks like well, two or three of my guppies are pregnant um and so I need like foliage and like hiding places for like the little babies to hide because if they don't have a hiding place, um, their parents will eat them after, like, when they're tiny. So, yeah. The thing I'm playing with out of frame is another little plant thing. My tank is, like, theme, like, purple and, like, kind of creepy. So I got purple plants. This one's, like, feathery? I don't know. I think the fish will like it, though. They do like plants a lot. And then I just got some biological booster. It's just, like something you put in your fish tank to make it healthier and that's all I got I was really just running errands today and then I had time to go to Ulta and spend all my good girl points and so I did and that was like the highlight of it all but I'm excited to set up my fish tank I might put a little bit of that in here I'll show you my new guppies okay so here's my tank I'm gonna do like a 25% water change and then rinse all the new plants off and put them in. Um, here's my little guys and gals that I already have. And then here's my new ones. These are the two males. I don't know, they're kind of tweaking right now. Can't see them very well, but um, I think I included a clip of them in the store so they look good. I didn't get a clip of the females. Hopefully they're calmer. Um, but oh yeah, see that one? See its markings? And then the orange one is so vibrant. And then this one has like blue tones that I haven't seen at my local store before. So that's really awesome. There's me. <laughs> and I will show you guys what the tank looks like when I'm done changing it and cleaning it and all that stuff. <laughs> guppies in their tank. 
Um, and there's a Pleco right there in the corner if you can see them. They have two of those in there and they're really big boys but they don't come out very much unless it's nighttime. Um, I have to watch the guppies while I feed them because I have to watch and see if the pregnant females are eating. Um, it looks like they all are eating so that's good. Um, but about 24 to 36 hours before they will lay their babies they will like refuse food or spit it out so that's a good indicator for me to watch to know if we're getting some more fry in the tank this guy he's just so cool he's one of my new ones today he's too quick if you're interested in guppies or aquariums or anything like that in general, let me know because I could talk about it um, literally forever. My plecos, they're my big boys. You can kind of see one in the corner over here. They don't come out much unless it's nighttime, but they sure are big. And there's that little handsome devil again. So I don't really know what kind of videos I want to put on here. Mostly probably just more like vloggy channels like me talking about things that I'm interested in showing you guys stuff like today um, I'll probably do a video about me dyeing my hair because I'm gonna go from This pinkish purple which is blonde underneath to like dark cherry brown with a red Balayage maybe if we can succeed at that if not I got an extra thing of brown hair dye to cover up my mistakes. <laughs> if you guys are interested in fish, I would love to talk about them more. Uh, my guppies are like my sweet angel babies. I love them so much. Sorry, I keep looking at them. They're like behind the camera, but yeah. Um, I have two neon ones that have the leopard spots on them, a male and a female, and I'm honestly thinking about breeding them in a separate like smaller tank before so I was really excited when I saw them today and I couldn't help myself as you could see so I got five new guppies today um but yeah I'm excited to um see what how they react to the new tank I'll make updates on the guppies and um my hair of course um so if you are interested in that or any other random stuff that I find worthy of vlogging about uh, hopefully you tune in soon.